Today we are dishing about a shed defender. Okay, so this is a dog product, uh, <laughs> and it is a very unique product. Uh, here, I'm going to just show you exactly what get it looks full like. Full demo. Oh yes, we are. Okay, so. <laughs> All right, it looks like a little, I didn't really know what the, the bottom or the top was, but it is like a little onesie. Okay, so basically this onesie is intended to be worn in the house, car, anywhere. You don't want dog hair, okay. dirt, dander, right. allergens, that sort of thing. So it's a patent pending product. Um, and uh, here, we're going to show you a picture. Uh, this is what it is, okay? So um, a lot of people will use this um, when they're traveling. Let's say you're going okay. to an Airbnb. Right. Okay, you don't want... It's your not your house head. and everything. Exactly, and mm -hmm. some people are allergic to right. dog, you know, right. hair. So you can do that. Or I just had a rental car actually, and they told me oh. you can't have a dog in the car oh. because of the it could shed. Okay. And people are allergic. Um, or if you're going over to someone's house, or if you're having a visitor over, right. they're allergic. Right. So it can come in handy. It has other uses though. Um, it can it, it supposedly can help reduce anxiety. Um, oh. Has can can have medical uses and yeah. stuff like that. Um, and you've heard about the uh, I don't know if they're called a. Uh, Thunder jet. There's some type yes, of. Yes, that's what I was yeah, thinking of when you right. during storms and stuff. You stick the the dog or whatever it Thunder is in jacket. there, and somehow it calms them. Right. Type situation. Exactly. So we have a picture of uh, a happy dog. Oh. The, <laughs> so, <laughs> this dog loves the shed defender. So very happy oh, dog. Gosh. Um, so clearly it can it can work for some pets. Uh, I wanted to try this very product form -fitting. out on my uh, Chewini yeah. Wendy. So, uh, Do they have the right size? Okay. <laughs> Her, oh, okay, it's a little, it's a little big. Okay, this is, okay, I did order the size small, and this is Wendy in she the, can't uh, fear, the She can't defender. find her feet. She, okay, oh. <laughs> this is in the process of putting the shed defender on. She kind of got a little stiff on me when I put it on. Uh, I think we uh -huh. have one more picture of it, uh, the very first picture I put on of her getting into this. And uh, yeah, there we go. Uh, <laughs> Violently fighting she, back. She, she wasn't violent. She wasn't okay. fighting back. Uh, she was just very concerned about what was happening to her. <laughs> the good thing is, is that Wendy doesn't shed that much anyway. Kay. She was just kind of a guinea pig to try this out. See how it worked. It, Wendy doesn't like having things on her, especially yeah. on her head. Yeah. So this little, ooh, oh, that's the bag. That's the bag. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this little part went over her the ears. The neck thing. This, uh, I, I get so turned. This part, yeah. yeah. The neck thing. I think that's the thing that she didn't really like. Right. Um, but I'm wondering maybe if she had some time to get used to it, she would be a little more warmed yeah. up to yeah. it. But I think, I mean, yeah, it sounds like a good idea, especially if you're going somewhere where you're just, you're trying to uh, accommodate, you know, being in a place where you're not, you can't have hair all over the place. And because that is a problem sometimes, or certain people have issues with it. We all know those dogs that you walk and yes. let your, okay, my uh, parents have a white German Shepherd. Inside. I go there, I don't wear black because literally oh. I will just be white yeah. covered with, you know, or I'll be black covered yeah. with white yeah. all over, white hair everywhere. So I might need to order one in a large for uh, Maya, and my parents' dog. Drop by and. <laughs> yeah, just like, hey. Stick it on. Yeah, I thought that Maya might like this. Uh, who knows? She might like it, but unfortunately, Wendy wasn't the biggest fan. So um, I may, if, if anyone out there has a small dog who would like to control shedding, um, let me know. Um, I can totally hook you up with the shed defender. A so. dog that's just a little bit bigger than a Wendy. A little bit Doesn't bigger, have yeah. quite the turtleneck <laughs> look going. I know. I wonder if they come in extra small because Wendy's kind of in between sizes. Yeah. She's not necessarily an extra small. Right. She's like 11 pounds, yeah. so she's kind of in between sizes. <laughs> but anyway, I thought that was fun to share uh, with you today. It looked like she was dealing with it. Yeah, she was struggling <laughs> through it, but anywho, fun times.